It's Thursday, June 11th, 2015. I've got both dogs, or two of the many dogs up here who have been here before, Galway and Willow. Uh, so I changed my mind on where I was going to put the well. I, I looked for a place uh, that was higher than the cabin and uh, found one, fortunately. So there's an underground spring that I found. That's just a test hole I dug with my hands. Uh, this is one of the springs that feeds the stream that's to the right of the cabin. Uh, we've had a lot of rain the past couple weeks, which made this easy to find because I could hear it underground. So, um, started digging a little north of that, and and I found it right where I expected to find the spring. So that's where I hope to have a well, um, as long as there aren't any rocks too big to go through. So far I've already pulled out all of those, but um, none of them are too big to lift out uh, all my own, so that's fine. Those pink streamers up there just marking my property line, since I'm very close to it, I wanted to know um, exactly how close I was. But uh, right now the, the spring is flowing great. Like I said, we've had a lot of rain, so only time will tell if it ever dries up. But this way I can uh, get a gravity fed line all the way to my cabin. And um, this is at about, well the top of this hole is about 13 and a half feet above the floor of the cabin. I figured that out last night by shining a laser pointer at the cabin. Um, made sure it was level. So, 13 and a half feet. After a buttload of measuring and using levels and laser beams and all that fun stuff, I finally have the corners of the addition marked. So where the pink line crosses, that's where the actual corners are going to be. This is of course the porch. It will be the porch. There's where the porch will end. So that's not actually a corner, but um you know, corner of the cabin, between the cabin and the porch. It'll be the end of the cabin. And you can see the rest of it. It's neat to finally get a real feel of the size of it. So the next thing to do will be digging the holes for the cement piers, which I have marked with flags. The flags, of course, will disappear once I start digging, but I can always um, put this string back and, and I'll know exactly where the corners are going to be because these stakes are going to stay put until I'm done with the foundation. Just a wider view of everything. I'm going to take the string down because uh, the freaking dogs keep running right into it. <laughs> 